In this question, the mass of a pendulum is changed from m to 4m, and its length is changed from l to 0.25l, and we have to decide what happens to its period. Using this equation from subtopic 9.1, where t is period, l is the length of the pendulum, and g is the gravitational acceleration, I can write an equation for the pendulum with mass m and length l. So then I get t is equal to 2 pi times l over g under the square root. Let's now write an expression for the time period of the pendulum with the changed values. I will name it tx. So then I get tx is equal to 2 pi times, and the length is 0.25l over g, and this is under the square root. You have probably noticed by now that the mass has nothing to do with the period of the pendulum. I will work a bit with 0.25 under the square root. Well, this is the same as 1 fourth under the square root, which is equal to 1 half or 0.5. Taking 0.25 out from under the square root and converting it into 0.5 in the expression, we get tx is equal to 2 pi times 0.5 times L over G under the square root. From this we can clearly see that Tx, the new period, is half of T, so it is equal to 0.5T, making A the correct answer.